what is going on guys it's Adrian Racing and welcome back to another YouTube video and today we have my favorite off-roaders and we are going to do a quick unboxing so first we have the Range Rover Classic and the, Land, the Toyota Land Cruiser 80 and these are my favorite because I'm a huge off-road fan and I'm sure you like them too so we are, we are going to quickly unbox the cars right here and there you have it so both cars look amazing they are amazing to just touch and hold and we're we going to start with the land cruiser first because why not so right off the bat you can see uh overall it looks like an amazing car the color is insane it's sick it's amazing and yeah we're just going to dive right into the details so on the right side of the vehicle we've, we've got this bunch of sponsors all around the car and yeah so there's also a 1.5 they're not really sure what that means bunch of sponsors there page rs yokohama race and there's also this um week the side mirror for this car you don't really see the side mirrors in a lot of cars actually but this car has the side mirrors which is a nice nice little detail it's a nice little touch to the car it really gives the car a lot more flavor and the wheels they spin amazingly as well you can see the wheels are these um brown color with gold trimming around the rims as well as the spokes which is amazing it's always nice to watch and the front relatively nice detail you can see the black panel right there with the headlights and the tow hook at the front right the winch and the hook that's amazing i think it's a very subtle very nifty little detail and it's very nice to see that um hot wheels put it in the mainline edition because you know most of the time you don't, you don't really see a lot of details and if you look at the left side same details as the right the the sponsorship stickers around the page yokohama race the ml overland 1.5 hot wheels logo and so on and so forth oops so yeah the wheels spin amazingly well like i mentioned to you i'm a huge fan when it comes to great functionality i would say and overall i think brilliant job on the casting i think hot wheels did an amazing job you can see the interior as well if you can just get the right angle you can see it's a five seater if i'm not wrong there's a five seater with the steering wheel right there very nice and if you look at the back here's where it gets a little disappointing because there isn't any detail so there's the wheel but if you realize the wheel is black uh it would have been nice if it was brown right it will match with the current tires but uh it's black it's black i which is but it's still nice you know to see, see the spare tire right there and then you got the mud flaps but yeah relatively the rest is actually quite plain the back is plain the top view right here relatively plain as well no, there's any details but there's a sunroof which is nice and if you look at the base we can see the muffler at the back but that's about it um like if you guys have seen my youtube video you guys know that i like a base with details but there isn't any so you can just see the Toyota land cruiser 80 the top hot wheels logo that's about it for the base and now we're going to move on to the range rover classic and this car i would say i like this way more than i like the toyota and for me we're just going to start the sponsor stickers you know you've got the land rover logo the michelin castro hot wheels the 81 and another land rover sticker at the front as well the hella which is the dash cam camera um dash cam company if i'm not wrong and yeah so that's very nice to see the details in the car i'm a huge fan of range rovers as well i think they're very nice cars the wheel spin amazingly well you can see the black with the gray trim very much similar to the range to the toyota cruiser you know they carry the same concept when it comes to the color of the rims and the wheels and yeah overall i think it's a very nice car as well you can see the suspensions i think that's what it's supposed to de depict at the mud flaps as well which is really nice to see um those attention to details are what makes this amazing and if you look at the front we've got the headlights as well i'm um, not and then of course there's the 81 and if you just look closely it says the terrain challenge right which is all which is quite consistent with the car there you can see this sticker in three areas the two sides in the front right here the castrol um decal as well which is really nice to see and the black with red which just comes complements the color and if you look on the left side of the vehicle the same 81 with the you know the challenge sticker right there the land, Ro the land rover the castrol um michelin as well so yeah, really nice um the and there are no issues with this, the the um casting everything looks great and if you look at the rear of the vehicle you can see the range rover right there the rr classic which is actually the name if you guys uh just remember um this is called the range rover classic right um it says here on the card as well range rover classic so that's what they did with the bag the number plate they just put it as rr classic which is really nice very nice detail i think that's amazing and the little bumps around to just depict the actual rear view rear of a range rover i think this is amazing if you look at the top view once again honestly this beats out the range rover when it comes to um the design of the vehicle however there's an issue like i mentioned the base you can only see the muffler at the back but that's about it 
right there the mufflers right there but that's about it you can't see there's no more any ad- additional detail but if you realize you know the made in malaysia and the trademarks is at the back usually you get it at the side but it, this isn't in the middle and it's at the back which is something i've not really seen often but it's obvious it's even if there, it's really nice to have this in the car collection so guys let me know in the comments below between these two cars which would you pick and why i honestly would go for the range rover i think the range rover is an amazing vehicle and the color scheme the black on red and uh, red on black sorry that looks amazing and then we're gonna do a few rolling shots and i'll see you at the end And just like that guys this video is over i hope you guys had an amazing time i had an amazing time unboxing these vehicles let me know in the comments below if you guys like this and let me also know what you guys want to see next don't forget lastly don't forget to check out the link in the description below for my socials but just like that guys this video is over and i'm out bye